Hey guys, welcome to the channel. My name is Derek, and yes, I'm wearing the same clothes I've been wearing the last three or four videos. Main reason is because I filmed everything on the same day. So I'm not being dirty, I'm just, you know, I just filmed on the same day. <laughs> but today, on our video today, as I'll have to repeat myself, we are opening up Japanese Burst Impact, something I'm excited about. Lugia is one of my favorite Pokemon, and I'm hoping we get a full art Lugia. And I figured, you know, let's just do that. And the next video, we'll have Miracle Twin and maybe some more Shining Fates. We still haven't pulled that Charizard yet, or the Marnie from Shining Star V, which we opened up two boxes of Shining Star V. So that's that's been exciting. Um, I wanted to surprise you guys with a lot of content this week, just due to the fact where last week we wasn't able to really do much due to the snowstorm. Uh, well, ice storm for us, it was pretty bad. Um, but things are better, things are melting off, uh, internet's back in good shape, and you know, I'm pretty excited. So let's go ahead and get into this. All right, so here we go. We got our burst impact. Let's go ahead and get it out here. There are 30 packs here compared to, like I said, Chinese RV had way less than that. It had 10 packs. Uh, these have only five cards in them, which kind of sucks, but kind of makes up a little bit for it. Um, but let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna, I'm actually going to try to use scissors this time. This to see, I'm, I'm actually afraid to. You know what? I'm not gonna do it. I'm not going to do it. Not happening. All right, let's see what we got on our first pack. We got the deer. Hey, Ampharos. It's our rare, hollow. Um, you're probably wondering, you know, where's the codes at? Well, the Japanese cards do not have codes. Uh, I will be getting some more codes here soon. We'll do a giveaway for March, uh, hopefully soon. Uh, you know how it is whenever you come watch our videos once or twice a month I do a huge mass giveaway of codes and you know I want to keep doing that uh, once we hit 500 followers guys we are giving away a free ETB I'm going to try my best to make it a uh, shining fates one so if that's something you're interested in feel free to hit that follow button hit that subscribe button I really would appreciate it as one of my boys what we got there we go, we got our first GX, and I do not know his name. <laughs> I'm still stuck on first and second gen, guys. Give me a break. <laughs> I, I Again, I, I started started back with Pokemon last year. Uh, this back in May, I believe. I, prior to that, actually, um, I was watching Max Mofo for a while, and I was like, you know what? I want to give it a shot. I'm going to start opening up cards again. But now it's kind of disgusting because... The only thing you see now is investment channel that don't really care about the actual hobby itself. They're more, oh, this is money, 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 money. Now, it's cool to say, hey, this card's worth this much money. But I'm tired of the whole investment thing, the market where they mark up every single card that comes out. Um, you can't get anything in the stores. Um, you know, some LGSs... Uh, uh, they tend to mark everything up as well, which sucks. I hate that. I hate that happens, but it does. There's my one of my favorite Pokemon. And Scizor is our rare. Hollow rare? It, it's weird opening these up and not seeing a ultra rare in every pack. You know, kind of sucks a little bit. But it's okay. Shining Star V kind of spoils you. I'm, I'm, I'm just saying, it spoils you quite a bit, actually. Is that Rookity? Snubble. Let's keep on going. What kind of set would you guys like to see me open up here soon? Uh, I'll try to get some more stuff for the channel. Uh, I, I'm getting ready to start my job. It hasn't started yet. And uh, we, I got a lot of planning to do. Oh, we got our first Prism Celebi. We got a Celebi Prism card. That's nice. We'll keep that for sure. You know, I used to have that card. I, I made a mistake. I traded a bunch of my 
Japanese cards for bulk uh, as bulk and I basically gave away all kinds of good stuff <laughs> and I shouldn't have done that that was one of the first mistakes I made I was too hyped up for vivid voltage and I was like you know what I'm gonna get me an ETB and open it up and I got nothing got nothing uh, but you know you live you learn Sometimes it's better to wait for something to come out rather than, you know, putting everything in one basket, basically. Well, I'm going to get that VMAX shiny Pikachu, which we still haven't pulled. So there'll be more vivid voltage down the line. I'm, I'm hoping that the market kind of starts to balance a little bit. There's our boy. There's our jellyfish boy. Uh, I'm kind of hoping the balance is a little bit that way, you know, we don't have to pay a super amount of money on cards. Like even singles right now, they're way up there for no apparent reason. I mean, there's, there's a reason for it. It just kind of stinks because, you know, collectors cannot get stuff. People that are genuinely, genuinely um, collecting for fun you can't get it because it's scalping season. What do we got back here? Uh, we got a Shuckle. Is that his name? Shuckle. Pretty sure it's Shuckle. Shuckle GX. I think that's his name. Pretty sure. Give me a Lugia, please. I think we're guaranteed at least one secret rare in here. Uh, in every Japanese set, you're guaranteed at least one secret rare, which is nice. But we don't know what's what it's gonna be. The hair cross. We don't know. I, this is the first time I ever opened a set, so I'm I'm kind of I've got some cards from the set that I bought in singles a long time ago, but I never actually opened up the set before. Some of the Pokemon I do not know by name, which that's okay too. Uh, Entei. Entei is our Hollow. Um. Again, yeah, I'm just I'm still stuck on Shining Star V. I can't help it. I can't help it. It it happens. You you, you get all those awesome cards. <laughs> I keep on hitting my microphone. So you're probably here and I was like, why is he tapping on the microphone? That's just something I do. I didn't mean to do it, but I did. I will be streaming this week. Uh, we did not stream anything last week. The most we had, we had a video where we opened up some Shining Fates on Saturday. Ah, oh, Typhlosion. There we go. I love, I love Typhlosion. I love, I love that family of Pokemon. Cyndaquil, Lava, and Typhlosion. Um, they're one of my favorite lines in the whole series, um, which I'm still learning. Uh, Pokemon Go has helped quite a bit because I've been playing Pokemon Go since it came out. Um, and they have all the other generations, and I also have all the Pokemon games currently, which we're streaming Let's Go Pikachu right now. We're expecting on the 27th, though. On the 27th, they may be announcing something pretty big for Pokemon in terms of gaming. Uh, we may see our 25th anniversary set, uh, the new Pokemon games for the Switch. We got Raikou. There we go. Are we going to get a Suic Suicune? Is it Suicune? Suicune. Suicune. Dude, we're not doing too good on this. Not really. Not really good. Give me a Lugia. That's all I'm, all I'm going to ask for. Is give me Lugia or give me... <sighs> eh, that means a rainbow. Rainbow Shuckle. GX. Um, I'm not going to complain. Not complaining there. It's not a Lugia, but... I think that knocks us out of our secret rare. Well, that's our hybrid rare. That might knock us out of our secret rare, though. I'm not 100% sure on that. We'll find out hopefully soon. Oh, there we go. There we go. <laughs> I've been. This has been in my wish list for a while, so it's good to see that. That's what I wanted. <laughs> I'm. A, I'm pretty happy now. Accomplished. I don't need that card. I don't need to have that in my list anymore. <laughs> good for good for me. Good for me. 
<laughs> uh, dude, I'm actually really slap happy right now because, like I said, I really wanted that card. I, I, I wouldn't mind having the full art one, but, you know, that one will do. That will do, Gig. That will do. Let's keep on going. Better act slow king. We have we have a few packs left to go. It is I know this is one of the longer videos. Like, man, why is, why is this video so damn long? Well, it is 30 packs. So I mean the next couple of videos are gonna be that way. Most likely. Alright. We have a what is his name? Meganium? Meganium? A lot of is it Johto? Maybe it's Johto. It's not Kanto. Kanto's Gen One. I think Johto's Gen Two. I'm seeing a lot of Gen Two Pokemon here. Lots of Gen Two. So I don't know if that's on purpose for the set. And we got the Legendary Beast. I used to call them when I was a kid. I used to call them Legendary Dogs. What do we got back here? I see something. Okay. Okay. We'll keep that. I'm not going to turn that down. I don't know the Pokemon's name. You can laugh at it. Just don't judge me too hard, please. Please don't judge me too hard. <laughs> All right. Keep on going. We have three packs left. I I don't know. I, I'm pretty sure that knocked us out of the secret rare. I think because that that's a hyper rare. So I don't know if it knocked us out of the secret rare. And there we go, Suicune. We got all the legendary dogs. I mean, legendary beast. We got them all uh, from this. I mean, they're not from you know the same, but you know, we got them all from this actual box. This was a very, very good, very, very good box for me personally. And we're getting ready to head into the last pack. Give us some last pack magic. Anything good. Anything good. Give us something that's good. I haven't seen any full art trainers, which I don't know if there are any on this set, but it does look like we have something back there. It might just be a regular hollow. Oh, there we go. We have a Blissey. Oh, not going to just turn it over. Just throw it over. Okay, so there we go. We got the card that I really wanted in the set. Uh, a few other surprises. Um, yeah, it would have been nice to get the full art rainbow version of Lugia, but I'm happy nonetheless. Um, yeah, that's definitely... I don't need that in my list anymore. So I could take that off happily and put everything else up if this is your first time on a channel feel free to hit that follow button hit that subscribe button uh share the channel uh definitely would appreciate it uh we'll be doing more and more as time goes um i i want to make sure you guys get enough content and uh, you know i i just hope you guys really enjoy it uh, it means a lot to me and means a lot to see that people are actually stopping by to check out the videos um we're not going to be talking much about investment because i don't really care about that uh, yeah, it'd be nice like 10 years down the road to look at it that way, but as far as I go, I'm just a collector. I don't, I'm not worried about making money on it. I'm just worried about having fun and all that stuff, and I hope that's something you guys do too. But all right, you guys have a good day, and I'll see you soon.